Neva Jain here. Welcome to Z Business and another episode of The Big Idea as we catch up with revered, renowned energy healer extraordinary Mr. Pankaj Gupta. ever felt a real good vibe emitting from someone or vice versa? Have you ever felt high on energy at one point and vice versa? Have you ever felt on top of the world and feel you can conquer anything and then dramatically the opposite? These feelings, emotions and beliefs are all in effect different energies. We have as our guest this week, Pankaj Gupta, a world-famous, renowned energy healer, a success coach, a life-transforming coach, and a business coach. And through a very modern, cutting-edge, meditative process called EFT, Emotional Freedom Techniques, he has impacted, assisted, guided, and improved the lives of thousands and thousands of people world over. Hello Pankaj, welcome to The Big Idea, wonderful to have you. Hi Neva, thank you for having me Well, here. Pankaj, a special thank you to you because you travel so much. That's right. So I think myself and our viewers are very lucky to have you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. It's so my much. honor to be here, really. Thank you. So Pankaj, you hail from a family of engineers, mm -hmm. from a business family, yet you are one of the world's most revered energy healers. How mm -hmm. did it happen? It's an extraordinary journey, an extraordinary gift. Yes. Share with us. Yes. Well, the short answer is my pain. You know, that uh, growing up, I seem to have experienced a lot of pain. Uh -huh. uh, when I was uh, 11 years old, my knee started to hurt and it hurt for years. I went to doctors around the world uh -huh. and no two doctors could even give me the same diagnosis. And oh. then my migraines got really bad. In uh -huh. college, I was very athletic. I used to get injured from time to time. That's such a young age. Yeah, yeah. And uh, by the time I was 20 and in engineering school, I was carrying a bottle of painkillers with me in my book bag, you know, and, and I don't think you would even know a 70-year-old who carries painkillers all the time. A oh, very good point. So, by the time I was 25 or 26, I was very frustrated with every doctor, with every system of medicine, because I was just coping, I was not getting better, and I was feeling like I was 85 or 86. But what was the reason, Pankaj? I don't know, because no doctor could tell me the reason. That was my question. Why am I in pain? Why, why do my joints hurt? You know, why... Uh, At a young age, yes. I'm looking at you today. That's right. You look like you're like in your 20s. Right. And, and in my 20s, I felt like I was in my 80s, you know. Uh, so uh, I reached a point where I was really ready for a change. Mm -hmm. And I'm sure that, you know, many of us have reached a point where we are really ready and help appears. Beautiful. So, so I had reached that point without mm -hmm. realizing it. I mm -hmm. saw it as desperation and my first healers and teachers appeared. Uh -huh. And wow. one of the first things I found was huh. this rather bizarre technique called EFT. Yes. So EFT. A, a, a friend of mine told me mm -hmm. about someone who just learned it in California, which okay. is where it was developed. Yes, correct, correct. And uh, I, just out of desperation, I mm -hmm. went to try it. Okay. And you can imagine my skepticism. You know, since my childhood, I'd been going to doctors every week and it didn't really help. Okay, so I didn't think this person could do and anything. this was a childhood yes, yeah. pain, yes, yes, so to speak. Yes, that's right. Oh so I went to this lady and what she asked story. me, what do you want healed? Mm -hmm. And I could have given her my shoulder or my ankle or my well, migraines well, or well, anything. Well, I'm going to be get, catching you for that one next <laughs> sure, segment. Sure, I do sure. want you to sure. share your gift with me. <laughs> and so as a skeptic, mm -hmm. I gave her my toughest pain, which was my okay. right knee, which at that point oh. had hurt continuously for 16 years. Okay, oh that God, didn't. At that young age, because I grew up with age. it, I didn't let uh, you know. I didn't let it uh, mm. slow me down. Okay. So I ran. I played. I used to do 10Ks when I was in college, wow. but then I would limp for days after that. You know, wow. and uh, three minutes later, 80% mm. of the pain was gone. I can believe EFT. it. Yes, just with this technique called mm. tapping. Okay. 80% of the pain was gone. I couldn't believe it. I stood up. I kicked around. I said, "Where did the pain go?" But how and long did it take? 
three minutes. No, you're serious. Yeah, three minutes. That means no, and you're And I joking. can tell you, it's been 16 years that pain has not come back. That was a moment that really changed my life. Because Epic moment. For my entire life that I remembered, I had run around to doctors and I got very little relief. And then I realized that the solution I was seeking was within me the whole time. And I wanted everyone to have the solution. I wanted everyone to know you don't have to suffer. There's magic. It's, it, it, it's available. Is it's easy. So this I told this lady, I... yeah. So I told this lady that, mm. uh, you know, I need to learn mm. this. I have so many aches and pains. And I learned it at a workshop. Uh -huh. And within three months, you know, I could sit on the floor. At the first workshop, I sat on a chair, you know, where everybody else sat on the floor. No. And in three months, I could sit on the floor for the whole day. And another three months, I could sit on the floor for the whole day without a backrest, which was unbelievable for me. So that means within six months, without requiring of medicine, medication, physiotherapy. Yes. But I did do a, uh, a bit of yoga, which okay. I couldn't do earlier again because, because of you my couldn't, pain. Yeah, you couldn't even because see I had so many oh. pains. So once the pain lightened, I was mm -hmm. able to do yoga. My and body got moving. And then within six months, I was sitting on the floor for the whole day. And I know it because I was reattending those workshops. What does EFT stand for? Parker? Emotional Freedom Techniques. Okay. okay. EFT huh. is a modern uh, huh. version of acupuncture and acupressure. Ah, and the real power of okay. EFT is that it can also help okay. you with your emotional pain, with your mental stress. It's not okay, just about physical I aches and pains. see what So it goes hand in glove with even anxiety and worries and absolutely, apprehension. Absolutely. Absolutely. Kind of I would say that physical pains mm. are mm. the easiest things to heal with EFT. The real power is in uh, EFT's yeah. ability to heal you of your phobias and your addictions and your fears and your old griefs and hurts and insecurities and anxieties and sometimes within minutes. And that's why it's called emotional freedom and that's actually what we want. We want to feel free, we want to feel happy. Yes, that's, what, that's what we all aspire for in life. Exactly. Beautifully stated. How does this, this is obviously a very modern um, new age module, science, whatever mm -hmm. you call it. How does it differ from pranic healing, Reiki, all of these other new age kind of energy? Well, you can think of modules. all these other uh, techniques, which mm -hmm. are wonderful techniques, as increasing the voltage of electricity. Ah, I like okay. that metaphor. Okay, and what so? EFT does mm -hmm. is that we fix your short circuits. So oh. if your circuits are still shorted, even okay. the higher voltage will give you limited benefits. Ah, very good. Right, very and good. if your uh, mm -hmm. circuits are clear, mm -hmm. then the voltage is good enough. Your breath is enough. Ah. One of the things that happens, for example, uh -huh. with EFT, often when people do a workshop, mm -hmm. is they find they're waking up earlier because now that energy they're drawing from their breath is enough. Okay. They don't have to sleep more to get more energy. They don't even have to eat more. So uh -huh. Very often, myself included, we started eating less after clearing our energy. Okay, so we eat less, we sleep less, and uh -huh. we have more energy. Oh, okay, and that is uh, without any mm -hmm. of these daily practices like Reiki or Pranic Healing. I'm a Reiki channel, don't get me wrong, okay? But you don't need that because that breath is enough if you can clear the short circuits in your energy. Yeah. That is phenomenal. Well, Pankaj, we have to take a break, but I actually want you, I want my viewers to see what EFT is all about. And I actually have a, a little bit of pain in my shoulders mm -hmm. the last few days. Let's see if you can work your magic on of course, me. Of course. Like you did it on your knees. Yeah, my pleasure.